Well, hey, it's Bruce Latch. We're at Time Moves R3 Finishing, Grand Rapids, Michigan. Uh, day two on his Zenith Stratosphere 16A63. Yesterday, you watch us on Crate It. Uh, we've been running late today, so we're going to do a video on a chassis and what that looks like for people that are interested. But um, as you can see, today we uh, I had stripped this radio. Corey's going to give you a quick little show of it. Here's the front. I've started to do a little bit of repair on some of this lattice. It's just broken, so we're using a little epoxy glue with a thin piece of veneer behind it to reinforce it. There is missing lattice here. I'm going to have to uh, rebuild that. I'm going to get some, uh, <coughs> excuse me, Veneer, veneer from my friends at Rice Veneer in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Um, maybe tomorrow morning and make that lattice. So, but you can see in here it's stripped up. Come on over here, Corey. It's stripped up really nice up in here. Can you see that okay? Yep. In the dark. All this is beautiful. There's no problem with any of that. Um, this is still all original here. That was broken there, broken here. We're going to make a new piece here and then we're going to make this section for over here, I'm gonna clip it in, keep it as much original as we can. I'd hate to have to build that whole thing. Here's the other side. And here's a little look at um, the inside of the radio from the back. You can see it's stripped up in here because as you open the doors, you can you see along here and here. Um, and this is the bottom side here. In order to get to the lattice to repair it, you have to take this whole um, oh, reinforcement, um, I'm gonna call it a plate, reinforcement board. Make a shelf. <laughs> shelf. Uh, there's two chassis. The bottom chassis sits here, the top chassis sits up here. Oh no, up here. The bottom chassis is down here. Speaker set on top of that. For some reason, at one time, I don't know why, but when this radio came to us, the top chassis, I didn't take any bolts out of that. There's not one bolt holding that in place. That's probably why the inner um, glass has been cracked, because of that, that wasn't bolted down. And the bottom chassis, I only had to remove one bolt. So I don't know what the story is on that, why the bolts would be all took it out like that. But Chassis looks real good. We'll do a video on that uh, tomorrow. But yeah, you can see this is what she looks like. And in order to get back in here to repair, um, you would have a board across here. You have a big speaker here and a 10 inch speaker there. All that has to come out to get over here because we had to take the grill cloth out too, um, <coughs> which all that stuff is all right down here. We got a. Uh, Probably the top chassis, I think. Yeah, yeah, top chassis, which had no bolts in it. Over there is the bottom chassis, but we'll do better videos on this tomorrow. Over in there are the speakers, <coughs> and over here is like the um, sound board. Well, I don't know, speaker, speaker board. board. Yeah, so, but yeah, we'll show some videos on that tomorrow. We just once again wanted to show you how this looks, and did you get a good video how it looks yeah. like? So the fun is gonna, the fun is actually happening right now. Um, once I get this lattice repaired in here, this radio is gonna be moving um, uh, very quickly. So, and that will take me a little bit of playing with, um, but it will be a fun job. So, but here you go, it's up to date on the Zenith Stratosphere. Um, have a good day.